So we've got wind, we've got microbial uh, fuel cells, carbon capture storage, we've got nuclear, we've got solar and hydrogen fuel cells. So there's an activity at each station where people will learn a little bit about that. Um, they get a stamp each one. And then so when they've collected six stamps, then they come to us. They answer our questions so we can see what they've learned and what their opinions are. Um, and then they win the energy rosettes at the end. I, I didn't know that so many people wanted to know about uh, you know, energy at a festival and uh, yeah, it's been really good. Getting quite hands on with it is interesting in that sense as well. And also how the, uh, the people teaching you are really good. They let us ask loads of questions and didn't yeah. ask some of the silly ones I asked about wind turbines. And I was very passionate about wind turbines. a minute ago asking me about my research and I was trying to explain that in a really simple way because it's quite complex um, and again when the kids ask me something about oh what's frequency you've got to really think about how to break it down and explain it in a really simple way so that's quite a challenge when you've been in like a research environment for quite a long time. We need to do things like this more really to engage people and when they're at a young age that's brilliant because if you can get people excited at a young age they're going to be the ones that are going to be sort of voting or, or making choices about the energy that we have in the next 50 or 100 years. The interest has been amazing. We didn't expect to be this busy. We've been basically flat out the whole time. <laughs> so which is your favourite one? Uh, probably the carbon capture. <laughs> it's been fantastic. I, 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 I didn't realise so many young people really actually still like science so much. But um, I spoke to a little boy yesterday and he said, and I said to him, are you enjoying the festival? And I know it's a bit rainy and a bit muddy. He said, it's great. He said, I just keep going around Einstein's garden. And I was like, that's fantastic. And he had about three of these energy rosettes. So he had been around. It's just, I don't know, it's, it's, it's quite reaffirming that there are so many people that want to take up science. Thank you.